I want to talk about someone who has shaped the modern era more significantly than almost anyone else we know. Someone who, until fairly recently, was relegated to virtual obscurity in many of the history books. A person who was responsible for the advent of things like the electric motor, the remote control, the AC current, which is the electrical standard in many parts of the world today. The effective use of x-rays would be nothing without him. So think of your medical imaging devices and hundreds of other, of other inventions and patents to his name. As a matter of fact, upon closer consideration, the scope of his inventions was so large that we would not, it would be impossible to imagine how we live today without those things. Because he holds over 500 patents to his name alone, registered to his name alone. And those are things that he chose to make public. The person in question, as you may already have guessed, is Nikola Tesla. A Serbian-born scientist who later came to the United States and with the financial backing from captains of industry of his day, like Edison and Westinghouse, created things that, goodness, would have been, again, difficult to live without. The focus of this video is to highlight how mankind almost lost that genius of Tesla. Now, in April of 1921, the article um, the American magazine recounts in Tesla's words how he read the book, uh, The Son of Abba, and he was only eight years old and resolved to keep every promise that he made moving forward. Well, the problem was that his parents had begun pressuring him to become a preacher. And in spite of his natural leanings towards science, technology, and inventing, they still wanted him to become, guess, a preacher. So Tesla states that perhaps the only thing that saved him from giving in to his per parents' um, pressure was that he became deathly ill. And this happened fairly often. And this was because he had spent long hours studying and, and ignoring his health. His condition became so grave that physicians gave up on him. And apparently his parents eased off on the whole preaching business for the time being. The pressure from his parents continued until one day, he, upon a specific bout of illness, with his dad on his side trying to console him, Tesla turned around and stated, perhaps I might get well if you let me become an engineer instead of a clergyman. It was then that his dad gave in and promised to let him study at the best technical institutions in the world. And the result to his health was miraculous. Once again, he recovered quickly and went on to deliver the many gifts and wonders to our world. While the story is intentionally abbreviated, it's not to be taken for granted. Why? Because for a brief moment, we almost lost the genius of Tesla. Family almost kept Tesla from living his purpose. If he hadn't made that promise to his parents, then things would have been very, very different for you and I today. Now, the sad reality is that there are thousands of these instances playing out daily where everything boils down to a single moment, a single moment of decision because decisions decide destiny. Thousands of people daily make that decision to walk away from their visions and ideals for their life for the false expectation of society or family. And because of that, the world may never see or hear the message that was theirs and theirs alone to deliver. So here's the deal. Family may stand in your way and tradition may be used to indict to you. But if you feel the urge for something different, please, please, Please do it, for the fate of the world might just depend on it, directly or otherwise.